What is up, YouTube? It's Jason right here, and today we have a new Legion Space update. So what this does actually gives us the ability to move, uh, change our sensitivity right here, move our dead zones, um, new button combos for opening up the Xbox Game Bar, and much more. So if you're interested, stay tuned, and let's get started with the video. As of today, opening the Legion Space uh, app, it prompted me with this new update. We're going to install it right now. Like we all know, it's a super quick uh, install. Won't take us long to do it. So I'm just going to speed up the video and we should be there in just a little. All right, as you can see, we do have a controller firmware update, which will actually enable us to have the dead tone and sensi sensitivity fix on our Legion Go right here. So there was a lot of issues with racing games in particular that the dead zone were pretty big. They were pretty big dead zones. So if you moved a lot, the controller, like the joystick, um, it just felt very sluggish when driving cars like, let's say, in Forza or the crew uh, and any, any other um, driving game. It just felt kind of weird and kind of awkward. And this is actually going to fix it. So. Uh, let's uh, let the Legion Space do the controller firmware update and I'll be right back. All right, so Legion Space has just finished updating plus our controllers. So right now I'm showing you one of the most important updates in my opinion about this new Legion Space update. So if we go to a game in specific, we are... All right, so let's say you're in a game and you are playing around, you know, and before this update, when you used to click on the control center, uh, if you start messing with it, the input from both the control center and the game will be at simultaneously. But now with this new update, you can actually change uh, what you do in the control center without affecting the game. So as you can see, I can mess around with all these settings and nothing will affect this. Nothing will affect the game itself. And this is a new Alt F4 button. So just in case that your Legion Go is hanging on a game or an application in general. You can click on the control center right here and actually click on Alt F4 and it'll actually close uh, the game. So as you can see, it just closed out of the game. So yeah, this is a really awesome update. All right, so a few other things that got added to your Lenovo Legion Go through the Legion Space update is actually a, a new button combo to open up the Xbox game app. So if we click on the Legion Space button plus a right click on our analog stick, we can actually activate our Xbox uh, game bar, which actually can help us uh, determine FPS and whatnot. And you can actually uh, open up games from here. So as you can see, we do have our stats right here. So this actually does help a lot when actually um, playing games or communicating with our friends. If you do use the Xbox game bar, you do play cross-platform games. Um, another thing that we that the Legion Space update did was our sens sensitivity. So if we go to settings and we go to our controller right here, now our new option is adjust the dead zone. So that will actually help us when it comes to racing games. A smaller dead zone meets more snappy, responsive um, analog sticks. So having it uh, smaller, a smaller circle better response having it bigger um, actually can help with uh, stick drift sometimes when you, your stick drift is a little just uh, just a little uh, too noticeable you can actually move the dead zone and actually fix that yourself um, adjusting sensitivity I don't mess with this personally but you can actually adjust the sensitivity of your uh, analog sticks right here and pretty much it you can do that but I like to mess with that inside of game not on the Legion Space app but you do have the option here. And last but not least, we can now uh, switch our button layout. So if we enable this, our start and select will actually be moved to the Legion buttons right here. So this will be your start, start and your select, and this will be your Legion uh, control center and Legion space button. So if you do enable that, it will swap them out. But since I'm used to it, I'm used to already um, knowing this is my control center, this is my Legion button, this is my start, start and select. It's muscle memory for me now, so I won't mess with that myself. So I won't enable that. Uh, myself and that's pretty much it when it comes to legion space 
this is all the updates that we get to Legion Space. We are, as of today, we are in Legion Space version 1.0.25 or 0.25, my bad. And that's pretty much it. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. And peace.